What's up guys, welcome back. Well guys, I'm sitting right here at a trail camera with one of my lithium boxes, I'll show you in a second. We're gonna check the battery level on this and we're gonna go back in the stud woods where I have my second box and we're gonna test the battery level on that one back there. You guys might have seen the recent video I did. Um, these were the first lithium boxes I've ever built for my trail cameras because I've always used like the sealed lead acid batteries and the ammo cans but I got tired of those things filling up with water and bugs and roaches and everything else and uh, I figured I'm going to switch over and try these lithium packs so it's been three months I put these out the first of June and it's the end of July I'm sorry it's the end of August now and uh, so that gives them a good three months and and uh, I expect them to last a lot longer than that. But we'll check the battery level on this one and we'll go back there and check that one and give you guys some idea um, about how, uh, how, how to gauge how long these uh, may last out in the field. Now, I am sitting on a, a cowpea plot here when it was younger. It's all weeds now. I just disked in some of it today. When this plot was in cowpeas earlier in the summer after June, that got a lot of activity here so this camera took a lot of pictures uh, so we'll see let's take a look at this uh, battery pack and see what the battery level is here's my little uh, stand with my camera and my box I just hang it on the, the stand and it does fine um, one thing to keep in mind is from the video that I did before the low voltage cutoff um, is a, around 11 volts and the high voltage uh, protection on the overcharge is 13.5. So the highest that this PCB board in here will allow these batteries to be charged is up to 13.5 volts, which is what I did. And then when this uh, camera will drain the battery down to 11 volts, that's when the PCB, uh, PCB board shuts off the battery to protect the batteries from over discharge. So um, we're gonna check it and see uh, where she stands. Now the inside of your jack is positive and the outside is negative. So let me uh, get ready to touch that. I'm going to put this up here so we can see it. I don't know if you can see that. All right, let me touch them. What's that say? Let me see if I can see it in the camera. Oh, this way. 13.13. 13.13 volts. Holy cow. Can you guys see that? 13.13 13.5 was the highest that it would charge to it, it hasn't even dropped down to 12 volts yet and it's three months in the field with a busy camera so that's this camera let's go check out the other one um, gosh at this rate this thing will be in the field for a year before I charge it so I'm gonna plug that plug that back in and uh, let's go to the other one and we'll go check that one You guys are going to see it when I see it. Positive on the inside. I don't want to touch it. Put it up there. See what it is. Y'all tell me what it is. What is it? 1309. This one is 1309. Which is good to know because it's consistent with the other one, which was like 1311. Or no, that was 1313. This was 1309. So these are pretty consistent PCBs in here and everything. These batteries are um, pretty consistent. So that's 13.9 volts. The other one was 1313. These have been out here for three months. Um, they'll be out here for many more months before I charge them. So that was my goal of creating something 
that I don't have to charge all the time. And they're easy to charge once you need to, um, if you have the right little charger to do it. And the uh, little adapter that I showed in the previous video uh, won't be a problem at all. But so far, waterproof, squirrel proof with the stainless cable on it. Um, and I like the way it hangs, it stays above the water, everything. So, so far so good guys, but I just wanted to give you a quick update on um, this lithium box. Because I know people are starting to build them because I'm getting emails and some questions about them. So, I hope that helps you guys. Take care. Um, we'll see you next time. God bless. Yeah.